my ninjas, today we are gonna prove if Casey, Chad's brother, is actually the cloaker! No! What? I will prove to you that it's not my brother. In fact, I know who the cloaker is. It's another YouTuber, and I will prove it. Well, we'll see about that. Okay. Once I put all of the evidence into my computer, yes. we can see if Chad's brother, Casey, and the cloaker are the same person. Where did you get such a program? How do I know it can be trusted? I got it from your own brother, Chad. This is what they use in the NSA. Hey, that's where my brother works. Okay. I'm speaking Californian, your language. I don't have an accent. Oh, Chad. Show me your evidence. Your evidence. I will. What evidence do you have? What? You said dance? I, <laughs> I was wondering what you were doing. Dance, dance, dance. Well, dance with this. Kick bump! <laughs> what is this, Regina? It's our first piece of evidence. It's a yeah. footprint! And whose footprint is this? You don't recognize it, Chad? It's your very own brother's. Casey's footprint! And what are you going to do with my brother's footprints, Regina? How will this prove that the cloaker is my bro? Oh, because we have the cloaker's shoe print right here. I am going to cut this footprint out and see if it's a match. And if it matches, your brother is, is looking Casey. Casey. Yeah. <laughs> my brother is Casey. I that is true! The cloaker! Come on! Your brother the cloaker, the cloaker, same thing! We have this footprint from the cloaker from yesterday's video on my channel. We played a little game and the cloaker was in the bathroom and he took his shoes off. We traced it onto this right here when he wasn't looking. There is no way that this shoe is gonna fit the cloaker's footprint. We'll see about that. Lay it on here, V. <laughs> Boom! Wait. Look at that! Size. Exactly. Size. Wait a second. Let me look at this. Okay, okay. The top matches with the bottom, but the width right here is different. It's different right here. No, Chad, if you look at the video, Daniel was tracing this and he did a kind of bad job. Oh, uh, I don't know. You guys are just trying to make excuses. It's pretty clear that the cloaker's foot is wider than my brother's foot. That means the YouTuber I'm thinking of, his feet are pretty wide. So that's why my brother's foot doesn't fit. Which YouTuber are you thinking of, Chad? You know, that one YouTuber. He's got pretty wide feet, you know who I'm talking about? Well, let's see what the computer says. What do you mean? Put it in the computer. Scan that big foot. No. Air dropping it to the computer. Okay. What does it say, Regina? It's a 41% match. 41? Whoop dee woo! That's less than 50%. So that means it's not my brother. That's only one evidence. We have a lot more that's gonna prove that Casey is the cloaker. What more evidence do you have pointing to my brother? It's not some random YouTuber, Chad. Look at what I got here. Oh, wow. A Project Zorgo voice morpher. Yeah, we sell those at Target and Walmart.com. Okay, the cloaker, he's got a pretty deep voice. Who does Casey? He has a deep laugh, too. <laughs> <laughs> Hold on though, yes my brother has a deep voice, but it's not as deep as the cloaker's voice. We all know that the Project Zorgo mask has a voice modulator! Yeah! So you think it's my brother's voice pitched down because of the black mask. Exactly! We're gonna pitch it down with this bad boy. Chad, get your bro on the phone. I'll call my brother right now and prove to you that if we pitch down his voice, he will not sound like the cloaker. Come on, gather around. What's up? Hey, brother. I need you to do me a favor. I need you to say something, and I'm going to record it with our Project Zorgo voice morpher. Oh, oh. Say, um, discipline is the yeah, freedom so. to, to the, the mind. mind. Can you say discipline is the freedom to the mind, Casey? Uh, okay. Discipline is freedom for the mind. Okay. Good seeing you, bro. I'll, I'll call you a little later and tell you why we're doing this, okay? Oh, uh, okay. Bye. All right. Okay. Bye. bye, Cloaker. Bye. Hey. I got his voice recorded on here. Okay. Let me pitch it down real quick. Okay. Let's see if this sounds like the Cloaker. Discipline is freedom for the mind. A little bit. It sounds like him! It sounds just like him! Uh, this is really close, Chad. Spy Ninjas, what do you guys think? Leave a comment down below. Do you think that my brother's voice sounds like the Cloaker's when you pitch it down? I don't know. I'm not convinced. <laughs> this is Casey right here! He's been on our fridge this whole time! Okay, okay. I will admit that does sound a little bit like the Cloaker when you pitch my brother's voice down, but... What does the computer program say? We need to feed this audio file into the computer and see if it's a match. Plug it in, plug it in. Okay. okay. 
Okay, what are you doing now? We're gonna see. Oh! Oh my gosh! What? 65% Chad. Chad! Casey and the Cloaker have a 65% match only based off of two things! Yeah, we have a ton of more evidence! However, and I think if you take anybody's voice, pitch it down, it's gonna sound like Cloaker. I've got a YouTube video right here of Unspeakable. Let's record his voice into the Project Zorgle voice morpher. You really think the Cloaker is unspeakable? Yeah! You're so wrong, Chad. Unspeakable lives in Canada. No, he doesn't! He lives in Texas! Texas? Yeehaw! Texas! Oh, Unspeakable. There we go. Boom. Let's record record it. You're like rolling around like a roller coaster. Yeah, I know. But and uh, there's we're, no exit. we're like stuck right now, like in this giant cube. It's cardboard, 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 cardboard. Yeah, yeah. So watch. We're gonna pitch that down, and he's gonna sound just like the cloaker when he says cardboard, cardboard, cardboard. Right. It's cardboard, 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 cardboard. That's the cloaker right there. No. Not Chad, it's a little different. That's the cloaker. Mm, that's unspeakable, not the cloaker. All right, fine, it wasn't unspeakable. That wasn't even the one I really thought. There's another YouTuber who I really think is the cloaker. Sure, Chad, sure. Mm, I don't buy it. Next clue to prove that the cloaker is my brother. What is it? Well, 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 Chad Wild Clay, I got a glove here. Belongs to the hacker. Oh, really? The yeah. hacker, huh? I mean, wow, the cloaker. <laughs> Good thing I'm here. If these two were running the show, you guys would be like, what is this video about? It belongs to the cloaker. The cloaker. You and your bro have like very similar size in hands. If you try this on, Chad, and it fits perfectly, that proves that the cloaker is Casey. Okay, but a lot of people have big hands, not just me and my brother, so we'll see. All right. Does it fit? If the glove don't fit, you, you must, must acquit. acquit. Okay. I don't know, it's pretty tight. Chad, really? Look. Yeah, oh, I don't know if it fits. Look at that, it's pretty tight. It totally fits, look! It's Velcroed up and everything, Chad, come on. Okay, yeah, but you know who else has a glove just like this? I mean, a hand this size? Who? Preston. Oh my god. I bet this glove would fit Preston perfectly. Oh my god. He's the cloaker. Have you ever even met Preston in real life? Yeah, yeah I did. Yeah, we actually have. And Brianna. Did you analyze his hands? Okay, fine, the glove fits. So now, are you gonna feed this evidence into the computer program and see how much of a match my brother is to the cloaker? Yeah. Chad, there's an app for that. It's just, you know, a ruler app on the iPhone. So you can just measure it and airdrop it to the laptop, okay? Oh. oh. Okay, airdropping. Regina, come read this. Oh, okay. Uh, 67% match. Oh, that's it? It only went up 2%. So there's still a 33% chance that it's not my brother. We have lots of evidences that will prove that it is your brother and yeah. not a random YouTuber. Yeah, 67% is a high number, Chad. After three clues, so what do you have? You got none. You got nothing, you bro. You gave us nothing. Because the burden of proof is on you. That's what they say in the all those courtroom shows. Next piece of evidence is Malik <laughs> the eyebrows. <laughs> Yesterday, the cloaker showed us his eyebrows and we got to see them. Yes. So were they hunky? They were okay. They weren't Daniel level. Oh. What? I thought we were over that. We are! <laughs> oh my gosh. Back to my brother and the cloaker. The true question is, are the cloaker's eyebrows a match to my brother's eyebrows? Because in that video where we had to identify my brother, we did look at their eyes. Check this out. The cloaker's eyebrows, uh -huh. Casey's eyebrows. Okay, do those match? I mean, they look close enough for me. Pretty darn similar. Yeah, Chad. They visually look similar, but this needs to be scanned and put into the computer program. That will fully identify that is not my brother. Airdrop, Airdrop the brows. Airdrop those pictures into the laptop computer. All right, oh. I'm gonna pull up yesterday's video, oh, take I, a screenshot, I already got it right and then airdrop it. I was gonna nope. do it. Got it, got it. We Accept did it. it. <laughs> I'll just stay back here and eat some oranges. They're cutie. Cuties. They're clementines. What'd you call me? Ooh. Hey! Well, that's your man. Yeah. Well, oh, Chad, the results are in! It's gonna go down to zero percent. Sixty nine percent! Oh my gosh, Chad! We're getting closer you know and closer to proving Casey is the cloaker! No, no, no. Just no, accept no, it! No, no, you know why? You know why this doesn't make sense? Because you can change the appearance of your eyebrows. Anybody can. Here, look. What? You've got some makeup stuff right here. Take my eyebrows and you can probably make them darker. You can change them. This will prove that the cloaker, maybe, is changing the look of his eyebrows. Oh. All right, all right. 
right. Yeah, Chad's brows need some work. Do they need some hunkification? <laughs> hunkification <laughs> brows. All right. All right. You guys know that I am a former beauty expert, but now I'm a spy expert. So if you want to become a spy and a beauty expert, subscribe to my channel. Yeah, you should turn your phone up this way, just like that graphic right there. And underneath the video, if it's red, click it. And gray. Gray is the way. way. All right, I am done beautifying Chad. Check this out. <laughs>
covered. Oh, wow. It's working. Look at that. That is covering it up. Very nice. Chad, I'm an artiste. So Casey could have easily covered up his scorpion tattoo. Mm -hmm. So let's see the final work here. This is looking really good. Look, check this out. Whoa, I can barely see it. Right? Whoa. The power of makeup. Artiste. All right, fine, fine, fine. You proved that you can cover up a tattoo. However, I think we need to feed this data into the computer, the information about the tattoo, the information about the fact that you can cover up a tattoo, and all that. And let's see where the percentage goes. Okay. Mm, yep. Mm -hmm. Yep. And, oh, it's calculating. Did it you, dropped. No, Regina, did you input it correctly? I did. Are you sure? See, I told you guys about the tattoo, so now it's only a 45% match with my brother. What? You guys are gonna have to come up with some more evidence, otherwise, I think this proves that my brother is not the cloaker. We need more evidence, V. This guy right here, he looks like Casey, right? Yeah, they're very similar in height and stature mm -hmm. and mm -hmm. mannerism. Since Chad and Casey are so similar, Chad should be able to dress up as the cloaker. Yeah. Oh, come on, Chad. What's Fine. That? I probably won't even look at the cloak because the cloak is totally different than me. The cloak is totally different than my brother Casey. Okay, master of disguise, Regina. Here you go. Wear this. Wow, good throw. Another one. Wow. Oh, do I look like the cloaker? Oh, uh, my, uh, my disguise skills are off today. You couldn't get a black mask. I mean, it was last minute. Hey, it's me, cloaker. I got a blue glove. I got a metal bow staff. Whoa. Meditation. Uh, I smell something. I smell a person who is undisciplined. Ah! Oh! oh my gosh! It's you! What's with you? What? You need discipline. You need to learn the ways of the cloaker. Breathe like this. Out the top of your head like a whale. <laughs> I guess I breathed in too deep. Chad, you don't make a convincing cloaker. Ah, see? This proves if I can't make a convincing cloaker, how could my brother make a convincing cloaker? Huh? Because your brother is better at... Cloaking. Cloaking. Thanks, B. No. I need better evidence than this. Another piece of evidence that the cloaker said was that he's an orphan. Well, Casey's your older brother, right? Yeah, he's older. So what if Casey is an orphan and you were born later? So you didn't even know that he was an orphan. What do I know? I wasn't born yet. I can't remember stuff from before I was born. Exactly, Chad. You didn't remember. Maybe your mom and dad want to keep it a secret because it's crushing to Casey to reveal that he was... He's, Adopted. Okay, okay, hold on. I don't think he is, first of all, okay? Why not? Because we look a lot alike, don't we? What else you got, V? Costa Rican. We've heard the cloaker talking about Costa Rica doing some missions. Yeah. Your brother is working for the NSA. He probably does missions in Costa Rica all the time. Uh, he does have to travel a lot. And I do actually remember one time he went on spring break by himself. He went down into Costa Rica. I bet if we factor all of this evidence in to the program, it'll give us the most accurate result. I'm typing it in right now. Yeah. All right. Costa Rica, Casey, spring break, cloaker, missions in Costa Rica, possible orphan, adoption. Okay, enter, analyzing. The likelihood that the cloaker is Casey Wild Clay is 72%. Oh! Hold on, that's way too high. There's just no possible way that the cloaker could be my brother. I need to get the cloaker on FaceTime right now. I need to see his face, okay? That'll prove if he's my brother or not. Where's my phone? He must be busy on a mission. Wait, here. Okay. Cloaker! Look, it's the cloaker! Cloaker! I need you to do me the biggest favor ever. You're not gonna like it, but I need you to reveal your face. I just need you to show it. Oh, oh, I have an idea. Oh, oh, Cloaker, we're gonna have a big uh, shindig at, at our safe house. Uh, that means party. Do you wanna come over? You know, maybe we can have a sleepover. Sleepover? Yeah. Yeah, you should, yeah. You should come to our party, dude. With a lot of snacks and meditation. A meditation party. Yeah, that sounds good. Oh. Yeah, I can do that. You'll come over tomorrow night. Okay. Tomorrow night, meet us at the safe house. Be there or be square. It's gonna be the most bombest party ever. Okay, yeah, that sounds good. Woo! We'll talk about taking down 
Yeah, yeah! That's what I'm talking about. All right, we will see you tomorrow. Bye, Casey. Okay. All right, guys, tomorrow on Daniel's channel, we are going to do a sleepover and finally reveal the cloaker's face so we can prove that he's Casey, Chad's brother. And once he removes it, it's going to come off like this, and he's going to be like, look at me, I'm Athmau. That's a girl, Chad, come on! No! Just ignore Chad, kickball!